Hello and welcome to another pen video from me, Penultimate Dave. So today I thought I would uh, show you some of the um, uh, cases I have from Nokco. Um, so these are um, a selection of cases I have. Um, I actually have the uh, Notco Sinclair, and then I also have, um, because I like these a lot, the um, Brass Towns. And um, so I thought I would show these off to you today. Um, but uh, let's just go through a little bit of history first of the company. So a little bit of back history about Notco. In 2007, Brad Dowdy started a blog that you're probably familiar with by now called The Pen Addict. It was a place where he could share his obsession with pens in a healthier way than hoarding them and building a small cabin in the North Georgian hills from empty pen barrels and cartridges. He posted about the good, the bad and the ridiculous. His passion for pens was stimmied by the lack of an appropriate vessel to carry his collection through the dark alleys of the stationary world. Geoffrey Brookwicky of Project of Seamster started sewing back in the Pilgrim years of 2008 under the moniker of Gnome Bags. His understanding of bags only grew as he moved from the Michigan ice flats to the lush forests of Georgia. The high temperature required rethinking the idea of a bag. He focused on designing around contents, not just designing silhouettes. In 2012, with the brand Alter MFG, Jeffrey sewed the first Mod 2 pencil case and sent it to Brad. It was almost a year later that their two obsessions found a platform to join, and thus Nokco was created. So, let's start with, if I move these out of the way temporarily, let's just start with the Sinclair. So, the Sinclair is, is a really nice, like, zip-up pouch, uh, and uh, it, all of Notco's cases are made of 1000D nylon, or denier nylon, which effectively is classed as ballistic nylon, um, by many in the industry and um, it comes with a durable repellent coating um, or water repellent coating um, so so you can get these wet uh, not absolutely saturated but um, it, it's like a lot of coats like that they will repel some water but then eventually probably absorb a little bit of water so um i wouldn't be like taking these out in the rain necessarily but it helps if you get to spill something over it um so it doesn't automatically soak it all up so uh, you actually have two zips here which is really nice so you can actually open it up and put the zips like over here if you want or even just put the zips at the top so I, I think what, what they've done here is really really good in terms of the case because if you just want to have quick access to your pens or your notebook you can do that so inside you actually have and I actually have a um, notebook uh, that I, I put in here and uh, it's just a uh, uh, a, a regular Lloyd's term type notebook really uh, it's a um, bendy bendy notebook uh, a, a6 style uh, and so you you basically have a number of pockets in here so like I've, I've got a, a, a cleaning cloth there um, and but it, it's it comes in a number of different colors so they, they do a different set of range of colors depending on the outer color of the case and the inner color and uh, I kind of like this color this is this is quite nice um, but uh, so you have a big pocket there so so if you want you can store an a6 style notepad or notebook and it will just fit in there quite tightly and then on the other side here you, you can see you actually have slots for three pens so I, I can put any pens that I want in here uh, and the, these are uh, Visconti Davinas so these are actually quite long pens um, but they, they fit in there really nicely and then you can zip it up now if you as I said like you can just zip it up 
to there if you want or you can put the zips all over one side or all over the other side as well um, and it's actually quite a nice little compact case um i kind of actually wish that there was a belt loop on here and i could like wear it on my belt um but i know likewise though that's not for everyone so not everybody would would want to see a belt loop there um or even maybe a a knockco badge like w i think would would really make this perfect um so you you have space for three pens in, in this sinclair um, you can actually fit more pens down the middle here. So if you actually have pens that you you don't kind of um, like mind sort of like touching together, like you could potentially like put another three pens in here if you wanted to. Uh, it will get a little bit tight, but it will still do up. So potentially, like if you have thinner. And, and shorter pens, you could probably put seven or eight pens in here. So so this is a really nice case. I tend to take, if I just want to take a, a little notepad with me, uh, take it out and about just to jot notes down, uh, and uh, each each um, Notco case uh, has uh, the, the Notco logo sewn into the uh, inside of it. Um, but so it, it is a really nice case, I find. Um, so that's the Sinclair. Uh, and you can get this in various different colours. So I'll move it out of the way. And then um, you have um, the, the um, Brass Town. Now, they do a number of other um, uh, cases as well. They're ready to look out. Um, uh, but I, I kind of like the Brass Town. Um, I've actually put a um, key ring uh, on here, just uh, London, England, um, but uh, um, so that doesn't come with it. But um, uh, be, and I just find it's, it's an easy way just to be able to pick up the case and grab it and uh, put my finger through, so it's it's just hanging there uh, if I'm carrying the case around with me. But but the the great thing about this is that, and again, different colours uh, inside versus outside. But this is a pen roll, so. Here you can actually fit up to six pens, and I say up to six pens loosely because I'll show you a little bit more. And again, this is made of effectively ballistic nylon or, or 1000 Deria nylon, and <clears throat> as you can see here, like there is a lot of space here so what you do is you basically just roll the pen up and none of these pens are actually touching each other because you fold this flap over and then you basically roll it so each pen is self-contained and now you have effectively a nice little pencil case that, that you can zip up and take with you and uh, so, so that then, then will hold like a good set of pens so you have here six pens so automatically this is now doubling the size effectively of the Sinclair which holds three pens with a notepad though uh, so, so you now have six pens in this case so th the thing is when you roll this up and I'll show you again because you you do have a little bit more space inside here you can actually if you don't if, if you have some cheaper pens you could actually stick a few pens down the side I, I know a number of people that do that or even on top here and uh, and then zip it up and then you actually could have maybe eight or ten pens in that case if you really wanted to uh, if you have some really really thin pens you might be able to get away with actually putting two in one of these slots i think it might be a little bit more difficult but um uh, it's certainly possible like that certainly might be something that you could do so so that's uh, uh another one of the um brass towns that um that i have so let's take this out of the way and then 
there's also this uh, which matches. I got this really to match the the Sinclair. Same color coordination. There you go. So you can see same inner. Um, and again, it's another good six pen roll. Um, and I actually do like a lot of these these color combinations as well from Notco. So uh, and, and the stitching as well. Like you, you can see here, the stitching quality is 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 really good. So um, like these are not going to rip very easily. Uh, and I think these will actually last a very long time. They're very durable, uh, both the inside and the outside. Uh, and I really do like the the seems to sort of work that that Jeff does here and uh, at, at Notco. It's it really is um, good quality. So uh, so that's another one of the brass towns that I have. And I went for for this one, which is a um, quite a bright sort of turquoise colour. But I. The reason why I went for it is it has a lovely black and grey inner. Um, and a again, like, the colours just match, I, th I think, really well from Notco. Uh, and again, like, you can see here, like, the colour coordinated stitching there. Um, so it kind of, like, disappears on, on this one. Uh, I, I th like, th they really do some very, very good work. And, uh, I, I, I cannot fault these Notco um, brass towns in any way other than I'd like to maybe put 8 or 10 pens in there like if if it was slightly longer maybe and had a couple more pens slots in there the problem is it would make this part of the case like the pencil part of the case the outer casing a lot larger uh, but uh, that that would for me be ideal if I could get eight or ten pens in there uh, but I do love the way that this rolls out it zips up uh, so unlike conventional pen rolls where you normally have a wrap that you put around it this just works extremely well and again like I just I, I like I like how these look uh, they're practical it looks like a normal pencil case um, and, and there's nothing wrong with a pencil case or a pen case. Like, they are useful. Um, and people normally just cram a whole load of pens in. But so with this rolled up, you can kind of see, like, I can probably get, like, a few more pens in here. Like, if I really wanted to, with that rolled up and still zip it up. So, like, I could, if I wanted to, at a push, get 10 pens in there. Um... Because I, I I I carry around grail pens a lot more, I tend not to want to do that because I don't want them sort of knocking around and bumping into each other. But I could put some gin hows or lamies or, or or some some other um, sort of pen in there that that doesn't cost so much, and uh, and and still take a like ten pens with me if I wanted to. And then the the last version of the case I got, which I really had to have. I, I for people that know me, um, I like orange inks, um, and this this really really does pop to me. Um, lovely, lovely orange, bright, vibrant orange exterior, black zip. I, I think it makes it look really nice, and. Um, when you open it up again it has this black and gray interior and again like that color to me just pops it, it's beautiful color um and it, it's it just just works so i know brad and jeff go through a, a lot of different color combinations trying to work out which colors work which colors don't work sometimes they're a little bit surprised when a color just just works like this uh, and this color really really does work so so like i have you can tell that i like these these knock brass tans because i have four of these so uh and i i tend to like take some of these to uh, like to our pen club because it's just nice and easy very compact like by the time you roll it up 
you have your pens in there. Like, okay, it only only holds six pens initially, but it's it's a nice compact way, and I can literally just take all of these. Right, so there's like twenty four pens that I, I can store in here, and I can just chuck this in my rucksack. It's not taking up a huge amount of space, and I've already got twenty four pens there. So, it, and and they're protected. They're very well protected. No pen touches another pen when they're inside the case. Uh, it just works out really well. And uh, with with the um, water repellent coating on the outside as well, um, just just helps. If somebody was to accidentally spill, I don't know, maybe a, a drink like a, a pint of beer or something over it, then you're gonna have it a little bit more protected than than maybe most uh, pen cases that probably wouldn't have that kind of coating on so I, I i think these are just perfect cases so i just really wanted to show these off to you today um if if, if you're uh, wanting um to get a uh, notco uh, sinclair which is this one or any any of these uh, brass towns or, or even their lookout or or other cases um then then head over to to notco um a lot of retailers uh actually sell notco products there's a lot in the us a lot in the uk and 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 in other countries as well so check out your local retailers there is a section on the notco website uh, that that will highlight where you can buy these cases from as well if you don't want to buy them direct uh, I think the the orange one I did buy direct because I couldn't get that sort of elsewhere but um, uh, but but the others I actually bought from uh, a combination of places I think it was Colt pens and um, uh, Nero uh, or pocket notebooks that they used to be called um, Nero notes that they're called now. So, um, so most uh, or a lot of retailers will will sell these. So, uh, just wanted to show these off to you today. Show how versatile and, and really useful uh, these these cases can be. And uh, yeah, um, thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you on the next pen video. Bye bye. <laughs>